Now I want to speak about the power. Each machine has a fixed rate of vibration. The tip of the FECO needle can vibrate forward and backwards at a fixed rate for each machine. But actually, when we choose a power of 10 or 70%, we change the stroke length. Here, we get a long stroke length in high powers like 70 or 80. Here we have a short stroke length in low powers like 10 or something. So we can modify the amount of power by choosing certain percentage and for each percentage we change the stroke length. The power can be given in different modulations. Basic changes can be in a continuous mood pulse mood and burst mood and recently new modulations are added for new machines so I want to discuss the difference between the basic modes first continuous FECO means that all the time we have FECO machine the ultrasound is on so every second the whole second is full with ultrasound and the pulse mood we have part of the second with FECO on and another part of the second with FECO off so we get less amount of energy pulses can be adjusted for certain number per second we can adjust the machine for two pulses per second four pulses per second ten pulses per second what does it mean? If we adjust two pulses per second, it means that we have in one second two cycles. First half of the second, second half of the second. And each cycle is divided into half on and half off. So if you want to know the interval of each, we get four intervals, two on, two off to occupy the whole second so each interval will be 250 milliseconds if we adjust four pulses per second it means that we are dividing the second into four parts and each part half of it on and half of it off so we have eight parts in one second the length of each is 125 milliseconds if we adjust the machine to 10 pulses per second means we have 10 intervals each have half on and half off so we have a total of 20 and the length of each L will be 50 milliseconds so regardless the number of pulses we have at the end in the whole second 50% of the time is on and 50% of the time is off it doesn't matter how many pulses you are adjusted but the end result is 50% of the second you have ultrasound on and 50% of the second you have ultrasound off the pulse mood is it, there is a character of giving pulses of energy delivered at definite rate of pulses per second which is the number of cycles per second the default cycle for pulse mode is to have the FECO energy on and then off for equal periods 50% on 50% off this giving a duty cycle of 50% FECO can be delivered in a panel mode or surgeon mode Panel modes mean once we get into stage 3, the whole energy will be delivered to the maximum. Surgeon mode or linear mode means that as we get the pedal down gradually, the level of energy will increase gradually. So if you say I have a 70% ultrasound, in the panel, once in the panel mode, once you get into stage 3, you have the whole 70%. 
while if you adjust your machine to surgeon mode if you start in phase 3 pedal position 3 you start by 10% ultrasound 20 30 40 then when you reach to the end of stage 3 you get the 70% you asked for so this is the difference between panel and surgeon mode so if you have a, a pulses and you adjust it for surgeon mode as you get the pan pedal down the level of energy will gradually increase till you reach the preset power you asked for like 70 percent power the third mode is the burst mode the burst mode you get an ultrasound then you have a long period of off no ultrasound then another ultrasound you can adjust the width of the birth between 30 to 500 milliseconds. What's characteristic of this burst mode? If you are in the early stage of position 3, you have an off period of 2.5 seconds. If you get your pedal gradually down, the off period will be shorter if you depress more the off period will be more shorter and at the end there will be no off period it will be a continuous FECO so here in the burst mode if the we just in the early position 3 we have a very long off period just two and a half seconds if we get the pedal gradually down the off period will be less and less and at the end it will be a continuous mode so this is the character of the burst mode so we have continuous all the time we have FECO pulse we have pulses on pulses off and we have burst if you get a surgeon control as you go deep in position 3 you increase the power till the maximum you want you set 70 percent at the end of stage 3 the pedal position 3 you will get the 70 percent this is for the continuous and for the pulse the burst differs if you press the pedal down the interval in between the pulses will be shorter and shorter till it will be zero so keep in mind if you have pulses the tip is pushing things away it's a repulsive force while in the interval where it is, there is no pulse then vacuum will build up suction will start to occur and vacuum will start to build up so you have two forces during the ultrasound on you have repulsive forces while the ultrasound when it is off the aspiration will bring the material to the tip and the vacuum will build up getting things inside so we have two forces one repulsive and one attractive we use the ultrasound to make el emulsification but the movement of the tip will produce heat the off period where there is no ultrasound we can make use of this period if the, vac the vacuum is very high it can aspirate the material into the tip outside of the eye without ultrasound so you can make use of the vacuum mechanically by taking some of the material out the second advantage during that period there is no movement of the tip so there is no he heat building up but uh, keep in mind to consider surge if you get a very high vacuum then you can get the material easily out but you can empty the interior chamber and you get surge for this reason if you get a higher vacuum then you have to increase the bottle height more and more to refill the anti chamber much efficient than when the bottle is not high now let's make some uses of the different moods 
Pulse mode can be adjusted into two pulses per second or it can be adjusted for six pulses per second. If we adjust for two pulses per second, then we have a long period on, long period off, long period on, long period off. We make use of this long period off to hold lens material. This is important if you want to fix the lens to make shopping or if you want to hold some of the material to bring it in the center area of the pupil before removing that material. So you make use of the long off period as a holding force. If you change your parameter to six pulses per second, we make this to remove some of the lens material like we do in scrap and sculpting or if we are removing the quadrants away. So we have an ultrasound taking some of the material, short off, then another ultrasound taking more material, short off and so on. So long off means better holding, short off just to take material out. If we apply this for the burst mode, if we press pedal to the very deep part of position three, we have a continuous FICO. We can use this for sculpting. If we have the pedal midway in the position three, we have some interval on and another part interval off. This is can be used for removal of quadrants. If you are in the just a slight depression in the position three, then we have a very long off. This is useful to remove epinucleus, then we can depend on the vacuum for mechanical removal, or it can be used for holding the lens matter as we want to do in case of chopping or we want to hold some lens and bring it back to the central area. So changing our position, we can make use of the ultrasound on and off periods.